friends, let's review the highway between China and Afghanistan, where this highway has reached. And when did the work of this road start? And where did it start? And now, where has the work of this project reached? Stay with me until the end of this video. I will take you to the border of China and Afghanistan at the highest point of Afghanistan. As you have already witnessed, the construction of a road from the small Pamir Dome in the Wakhan district of Badakhshan to the Chinese border, with a length of nearly 50 kilometers, was started a few years ago. Still, due to the recent developments in Afghanistan, this project was stopped, and then after a few months of suspension, the work of this project started again. And fortunately, the work of this project, which is a second-class road, has been completed until the border of China. Shortly, this second-grade road will be built as asphalt. This road, called Silk Road, is 5 meters wide and was built for 369 million Afghani. This road is about 50 kilometers long. 20 kilometers of this road was completed during the previous government and 30 kilometers of it have been completed by the Taliban government. This road has two bridges. The bridges are 20 and 30 meters long. Also, this road has several retaining walls. This road is for people who live in the Wakhan district. It is very effective. According to the plan of the Afghanistan government, this road forms a part of the Wakhan corridor, which brings Afghanistan a few steps closer to regional connectivity and economy-oriented policy. Wakhan is a mountainous area in Badakhshan that was previously inaccessible to vehicles, but the road is now grade two, to be essentially asphalt in the future and a transit route with China. This secondary road connects Afghanistan and China. Wakhan district is located in the highlands of Badakhshan. The weather conditions are different from other regions of the country. Therefore, in some areas, the weather is cold and snowy and the work was done with delay, but in others, when the weather is mild, the work went quickly. The Wakhan route is a short route between China and Afghanistan, through which raw materials and products are traded, and it also helps tourists to reach the Wakhan National Park. This is the first time that the Wakhan region of Badakhshan province is connected with Faizabad city, the capital of this province, through a motor road. This road was divided into two phases. The first part of the Pamir Badakhshan Road includes the construction of 20 kilometers of newly constructed road from the Broghill border area to Bezahe Gonbad. And the second part starts from the Bezahe Gonbad area with a length of 30 kilometers and ends up to the Chinese border. Currently, as you can see, this shows the border between China and Afghanistan, where the 50 kilometer road construction project has reached this point. This mountainous region is characterized by snow cover and rocky slopes, and the Silk Road connects to China from here. The completion of this road is of great importance for both countries and will help economic development and facilitate international trade. Here we see a part of the Wakhan Road construction project to the Chinese border. As you can see, this dirt road passes through a mountainous area. It is not yet fully built and its development works are in progress. In the background of this road, High and snow-covered mountains can be seen, which give a special beauty to the landscape and also indicate the difficulty of the route. The route of this road passes through valleys and rocky slopes, and you can see signs of engineering and road construction work such as the movement of rocks and soil around. This project is part of the big efforts to connect Afghanistan to China and improve communication and trade between the two countries. The construction of the Silk Road has been completed and has reached the travel point of the middle border between Afghanistan and China. Officials in the Department of Information and Culture of Badakhshan say that they have traveled to Wakhan District at the head of a team to monitor the works of the Kurds on this Silk Road construction project. At present, the Silk Road is connected to the Chinese border through the Wakjir Valley. However, road grading and some bridges and culverts remain on the road, and the work on them continues. The head of Information and Culture of Badakhshan says that the first phase of this road was started from the Ashkashim district, which was widened and coordinated by the engineering team of the Ministry of Dafa until Kandod, the center of Wakhan district. Some of its areas are ready for bitumen. The Silk Road connects to China from here, and the Central Line Road, which was started last year, has fortunately been completed. The investigation team of this highway says that we have come to this zero line with cars, 
and we have a message for those who come here as a tourist or tour, is to travel in this area with SUVs. Because it is a hot monsoon, it is a flood monsoon, and there is money and culverts on the way of this highway, whose work is not yet completed. Only here, only the central line is connected to the Chinese border. This route is one of the most important routes between China and Afghanistan. With its completion, many facilities will be available to the people of Afghanistan and Badakhshan. The Wakhan Corridor is one of the most important economic highways of Afghanistan and the region, and it is a route with historical integrity, which is the Silk Road that connected Afghanistan and the countries of the region to Europe, where the conditions had an impact on the economy of the people, and with its completion, the work of this highway will provide more and better facilities for the people, and then it will cause the growth of the economy in Afghanistan and especially in Badakhshan. The engineer of this project says that the roadwork has been completed and connected to the Chinese border, but there are still several bridges and culverts on the road, which are still being worked on. Currently, the road is 50 kilometers from Bezai Gonbad to the Chinese border. Thank you for watching.